cleaning out the basement here and came across a few treasures, a lot of junk. Okay, we're here in the basement and this was gonna be part of another vlog, but then we came across this big bin over here and we're gonna explore what other hidden treasures we have here Pictures. in the basement. AJ, what's your favorite thing that you found? A PSP. PSP. Let's see it. Yeah, pretty clean. Why do we save this? It's missing a joystick. It's not. It's missing a D-pad. It's missing a D-pad. We also found uh, another hidden treasure. Where's that 360 vision cam? Cole's repurposing that. This is my favorite thing, guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a little dusty. All right, there we go. Classic. Classic Xbox 360 cam. vision That's going to look sick on your new gaming oh, desk. Yeah. I got rid of about 300 feet of cable. Yeah, coax cable. Uh, DVI, right. do HDMI. AJ, what else did you find? Wii Motion Adapter. Oh, yeah. Wii Motion Plus. Oh, we still have to go for that bin. What bin? Why do you want to know what's in there so bad? Because there's controllers. Oh, miscellaneous video games? Oh, maybe we should go through that. This was going to be part of another vlog, but then we came across this big bin over here. Oh, it's not that exciting. Got, uh... The an icon uh, arcade stick for the iPad. Oh yeah, the rare coin. No, it's actually not worth that much. Money. We got the Super Mario Galaxy collector's coin. What year did this come out? I've looked this up on eBay. It's actually not worth that much. Like 13, 14 bucks maybe. Oh, I love the wooden face plate. The wooden 360 face plate. We got a wireless sensor bar for the Wii. Classic white Xbox 360. Okay, so you guys were not that impressed with the face plates, but let's, the wood one was sick. I didn't even remember putting it away. Now, these things were always a bit of a bugger to get off. There we go. So this is your 360 bear, and then put the classic old face plate on it. The little tray here is busted on this one. Talk about a clean console. That's pretty nice, actually, the white one. That's pretty nice too, I gotta say. We got an official Sony Clear PS2 controller. Let's see if we can... Come on, there we go. Oh yeah, that's pretty nice actually. This is a knockoff. It never quite worked right, but. Guitar Hero Mike. DJ Hero is actually pretty fun. This is kind of classic. Not rock band, but Guitar Hero microphone. We got Sega. Dreamcast control. Yeah, and pop out the VMU for the people. It's what, this? Game? Yeah. Yeah, I got it on disc somewhere. We got the VMP. The VMU. This is called, this is the virtual memory unit. So you can save your games on here and take them to a friend's. But look, hang on, there's more. Look at This is actually pretty cool. It's ahead of its time. You could play little games on there with the D-pad and the buttons. Wow. Nowadays they have the cloud. Cloud schmoud. This is the official. And this is what uh, Dreamcast players played with. But, but, when Dreamcast players brought their friends over and wanted to play a game with them, they gave them this. This is the knockoff uh, performance with a performance memory card. You'll see this is not a VMU. There's no screen on this. This one's just like a, like a memory pack. Got a power brick for the 360, remember that? When the Xbox was announced, people were like, oh, look how small the Xbox 360 is. And then they opened it up and they're like, what am I gonna do with this huge stupid thing? Still digging, I did find some other. Forgot about this. Oh. This is the Dreamcast light gun. Unfortunately, it only works on two TVs. This is for your, mem your VMU went in there. I don't know if Sega made an official one. This is a Pelican brand. I remember it worked for, oh, what was that? Typing, no, not Typing of the Dead. One of those zombie games. I think I have one somewhere. I'm sad it's over. All right, I did a little more digging. That is about it. Thanks for joining me from the basement. Until next time, goodbye, everybody!